next mi oh wait what next mission stuff what's this about boring stuff probably just <laughs> let's first do the one over here I always get stuck with this what's that need some help salve so many flowers your husband must be very lucky I am the lucky one I have you here to aid me let me see what I can do really just to Back deliver there, flowers I may have given you the wrong impression oh I have no husband the flowers are for a party am I invited Reducing distance. Um, now I fault to get freaking girls walking so slow. What makes you think I have class? I could tell the moment I saw you. No one in this town walks in such fair. I'm certain Ezio Auditori himself would be impressed. Oh, what do you know of Ezio? Claudia thinks the world of him, but he rarely visits her. From what I gather, he's distant. She is right. I have been. Oh no. You? The party was intended to be a surprise. Promise you will not tell Claudia. What will you do to keep me quiet? I am sure I can think of several things. I'll be waiting to hear them when we get there. Exactly the reason why I don't understand why I have to do all this party stuff when it's supposed to be for surprise to begin with. Do you want me to pick it up again? Really? I was putting it down anyway. Now about earning my silence. I have something in mind. There is one condition. Anything. You must wait until tomorrow. If it pleases you, I will not stand in your way. It will be worth the wait, Ezio. Trust me. Man, he is such a ladies' man. Why the heck does he want so many ladies at once? <laughs> now to... I'm about to say, do I only have one hidden blade? I shouldn't. I should have more than that. Okay, it's upstairs. So, these are the new cannons? Yes, Signor Ezio. May I try one? Yes, but... But... Go on, tell him. We cannot seem to make them work properly, and the fool who mounted them is nowhere to be found. Then it is up to me to find him. We do not want to waste your time. It is not any trouble. I have all the time in the world now. Not entirely. Find the engineer that's obviously displayed on the map to begin with, so... What's he doing sleeping? Salve, Messere. We need you to fix the cannons on the battlements. Leave me be. I do not begin repairs before noon. Do you know what time it is? I make cannons, not clocks. If you are busy, someone else will fix them. Uno momento. No one else will touch my cannons. Okay. Soldiers have no respect for artillery. They expect the gun to work like magic. You need to feel her out. Give her a little encouragement. We are only equipped with simple cannons now. But I got hold of a design from France. Yeah? A hand cannon. Something called a wrought iron murderer. Imagine firing a cannon from your hands. <laughs> that is the future. Yeah, it's called later games, literally. Plus, I have one in my got my. I have one now, uh, right in my own uh, gauntlet. Now, what is? He gonna do what have you done we used them they were not ready for firing you could have gotten us all killed let me see <laughs> his breath is more fatal than our cannons 
Only when you two fools are shooting them. There, try it. He never did anything. Aim at something to test the alignment. for your help. If you hear the cannons tomorrow, do not worry. We will be practicing at dawn. Too bad it will not do you any good. Very funny. Now fix the second cannon. I don't know what he caught possibly even touched for putting it on for a second. It's like, really? Buongiorno. Ezio. Mario is going to murder me. I have lost his favorite horse. Do not despair. I will bring it back. God bless you, Ezio. His favorite horse? Oh my god. It's like, really? Thank you. Uh, here. Grazie, Ezio. I can no longer keep up with the horses. Promise me, you will enjoy your good health. Do not spend as much time in battle as your Uncle Mario. My battles have already been won. That is good news. Arrivederci, Ezio. No, it has far been won if you let the guy that was after you the entire time free. Like, that was so stupid. Buongiorno, Ezio. Caterina, to what do I owe the pleasure of your presence here? I desire an allegiance. The papal armies have resumed their march on Forli. Your mercenaries would be a great asset to my cause. It is likely that I can give you what you seek. But we will talk later. Okay. Time to tell everyone Mother. the damn truth of my stupidity. Or I should say his stupidity. Machiavelli. It is done. Though not, I think, as any of us expected. I entered the Vaticano and faced Rodrigo. No, he used the power no. of the papal staff against me, but I defeated him. Combining the staff and the apple, I gained access to the vault. There, a moving painting of the goddess Minerva spoke. She told of a terrible tragedy to befall mankind in the future, but gave hope of lost temples that will provide aid to humanity. Then she called out to a phantom, Desmond, as if he were there, standing beside me. After her warning, she vanished. Amazing. I cannot imagine such wonders. The vault did not house the terrible weapon we feared. This is good news. What of this goddess, this Minerva? Did she appear human? Yes, but her words proved otherwise. All of her kind died many years ago. I wish I could show you the magic she performed. Magic, yeah, right. Who is Desmond? And where are these temples Minerva spoke of? I do not know. Perhaps we must search for them. Tell me how it ended with Borgia. Did Rodrigo beg forgiveness? Make excuses? Promise power in return? No. None of those things. Interesting. I'm surprised he remained so composed. I let him leave. The Spaniard lives? Duh, an idiot. Once our enemies are dead, we can speak of vaults and gods and ancient places. You should have killed him. We're sure to suffer for it. I know, right? I'm not here to debate the past. Together, we should discuss the future. No. I am leaving immediately for Roma. Ezio. I do not know why you spared him, but I trust your judgment. Machiavelli will come around. He shouldn't have left him alive because that literally screwed him over.
And now it's time to go into the vault, I think. Where are we going? Oh wait, no, it's upstairs, it's right. I'm just like, where are we going? Cause, not that informative of a map, cause going upstairs. And here. Now time for the pointless scene. Relaxing in a hot bath. Welcome home. And Katarina. Have you never heard of sleeping? Ready to go again? You don't need to ask. <laughs> One should always have the freedom to choose. Like I said, they never slept. What's that? Probably just training exercises. Of course you damn. Notification ruining the scene. I have to find Mario and rally the troops. My men are in the courtyard. I aim to lead them around back and flank our attackers. Stay out of sight. You know, it would have been better if you took your armor with you. At least the torso armor. Okay. It's the Borgia! How did we not see this? They must have massed to the east during the night. We need to hold them off until the townspeople have escaped. I will take care of it. Are you sure you will? Use the cannons above the rampart. I intend to lead a frontal assault. Do you have it? I am keeping it safe. The Borgia must not be allowed to breach the walls until everyone is safely away. Insieme per la vittoria. Insieme. It would be better if that's you, Be careful. I will. It would be better if it's you had it because then he wouldn't have to worry so much. His balls must have hurt from that. This continuous turning. Oh, going that way. Where's the cannon? Signora Vittore, thank God. We must put them back to the villager. The cannon, Signore! Aim for the cannon. 
Really, I didn't even get it. Oh, they changed it again. Oh, F you. Oh, yeah. One handed. Ow. There. Bam. Yeah. Two and two. I know you're there, Ezio! The Pope told me about you and your little group of assassins. Andres! Give me the gun, his friend passion for us! We've had too much bloodshed. I think the cleansing is in order. So consider this an invitation from my family to yours. Boom. <laughs> <laughs> 